morning and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the show and it's late in the morning so here we go Too hard to be outside, so we brought the breakfast inside. Uh, this is more like a brunch because it's brunch. Oh yes, it's so late right now because we woke up really late, like 12 o'clock in the afternoon. So, wow. Look at all these people. Those are, but we're special. We can have coffee and everything. And maybe I'm having no coffee. Uh oh, oh, and the, the breakfast pockets. Where's the water? Oh, the morning. Cafecito to wake up. Twelve o'clock in the afternoon, you still halfway asleep. All right, guys. So while we're here enjoying our late breakfast lunch dinner whatever it is it doesn't matter the time because when you're in the water i guess when you're hungry you eat so it doesn't really matter but we're gonna go ahead and uh let you guys enjoy the view outside while we cool off and eat our breakfast in the inside Okay, energy level up and ready to go. So we're gonna go ahead and take a cruise on the dinghy. And like you notice, there's more people showing up to have some fun in the sun. And as you can see, everyone's having a great time and enjoying the day. Even though the sandbar is closed, but it doesn't really matter. Everybody parks around the island and tries to keep their distance and enjoy it with their friends. And also, I enjoy when people are having fun and meeting people that watch the channel. <laughs> Hey, 
hiciste súper bien. ¿Te quedó bien? Fresco, Chávez. Bueno. Oye, aquí te conozco, bro. Justo, justo. A los muchachos. Estamos todo el mundo ahí. ¿No quiere salir del área en el Senado? Yuli. También. It's always great to talk to people that watch the channel and share the same thing in common, the love for boating. But now we're gonna go ahead and head back to our boat and check to see if the rest of the crew is out of the cabin. Because if they're not, they're missing out on a great, beautiful day. Now, this is going to be interesting. Ogida is going to try jumping off the boat. She has never jumped off the boat, especially into dark water. She likes to see the floor, so we're going to see how she does. Jump like you're going to land on that little black thing. Ready? You can't let, you gotta go. You gotta go because if you hold me, you gotta go because if you hold me back, you're going to hit the boat. Ready? One, two, three, three. Well, I'm really proud of Okita. She finally did it. And she's been wanting to do it for a long time because she always sees the kids do it. But she was afraid of hitting the floor or not seeing what's on the floor. So she finally did it, I'm really proud. And she was so excited that I had to hose her down to cool her off. And by the way, I posted this clip on Instagram and everybody seemed to like it. I wonder why. And remember guys, if you wanna follow on the daily post, follow us on Instagram, Fresco Channel. But now we're gonna keep cooling off here and wait for Doobie, cause he's on his way. So do we have arrived with his crew and you notice he has a packed house so I'm gonna help him settle in so he can enjoy the rest of the day here at Birkin Island. And we have a surprise guest. My friend Alain pulled up in his beautiful 50 foot scarab that it actually used to be a closed deck and he made it into an open center console and it had triple inboards and he took it out and put a bracket and put triple outboards and it came out pretty good. Well it's time to have some fun in the water and check out this new float that Doobie brought.
like my role. And well, like you already know, the kids smell the food, so they come out of the cabin. They spend almost the whole day in the cabin hanging out in the cool AC because they kicked on complaining that it was too hot to be outside and they didn't want to go in the water. But you know how kids these days are spoiled. But us, we had a great time and as you can see, everyone here had a, had a great time here at Birkin Island. And you're also going to notice there's a lot of people in the water. It feels like summertime when basically summer is over. But wait a minute, we live in Florida. Summer is almost all year round. And we also are boating with restrictions. Imagine when they lift those restrictions. Boy, it's gonna be entertaining. And also you notice that it's really hard to put audio on the video because everyone had their music blasting. And talking about music, I have a surprise for you guys. I'm working on something that you guys are gonna like, but I'm not ready yet to let you guys hear it. But when I do, it's gonna make you dance. Alright guys, just in case you didn't see the video from the previous day, make sure you check it out because we spent two days here on the water enjoying the beautiful sunny Florida weather. But now, it's about that time. It's time to pick up and get going and head home. But I would like to say hello and thank you for those people that came up to us and said hi on the boat and on the dinghy. Thank you guys for watching the channel. I'll see you guys next time on the water. Let's keep having fun.